Edward Jenner, born on the 17th of May 1749, was an English doctor who helped create and popularize the vaccination for smallpox. Through his pioneering work, he helped save the lives of countless people, and over time became known as the father of immunology and later vaccinations. During the late 18th century, one of the most feared diseases was smallpox. Like any other doctor of the time, Edward Jenner carried out variolation to protect his patients from smallpox. However, from the early days of his career Edward Jenner had been intrigued by country law which said that people who caught cowpox from their cows could not catch smallpox. Cowpox is a mild viral infection of cows. It causes a few weeping spots. Milkmaids occasionally caught cowpox from the cows. Although they felt rather off color for a few days and developed a small number of pox, usually on the hand, the disease did not trouble them. In May 1796 a dairymaid consulted Jenner about a rash on her hand. He diagnosed cowpox. Edward Jenner realized that this was his opportunity to test the protective properties of cowpox. He chose James Phipps, the 8-year-old boy and made a few scratches on one of James' arms and rubbed into them some material from one of the pox on Milkmaid's hand. A few days later James became mildly ill with cowpox but was well again a week later. So Jenna knew that cowpox could pass from person to person as well as from cow to person. The next step was to test whether the cowpox would now protect James from smallpox. On the 1st of July Jenna variolated the boy. As Jenna anticipated, James did not develop smallpox. Jenna followed up this experiment with many others. In each of the next two years he published the results of further experiments, which confirmed his original theory that cowpox did indeed protect against smallpox. Edward Jenner spent much of the rest of his life supplying cowpox material to others around the world and discussing related scientific matters. The technique of introducing material under the skin to produce protection against disease became universally known as vaccination. The word, vaccine, derived from the Latin name for the cow, vodka, in Jenner's honor. Societies and universities around the world gave him honorary degrees and membership. Perhaps the most significant tributes were the minting of a special medal by Napoleon in 1804, the gift of a ring by the Empress of Russia, a string and belt of wampum beads and a certificate of gratitude from the North American Indian chiefs. Statues to his honor were erected in Tokyo and London. He died on the 26th of January 1823. In 1840, 17 years after Jenner's death, the British government in an act of parliament, banned the use of variolation and provided the cowpox inoculation free of charge. By 1979, the World Health Organization had declared the extinction of smallpox. It was a remarkable achievement of which Jenner's groundbreaking work on immunization played a key role. Thanks for watching.